That is a solution, but there it is. Giovanno. Mm. Moving no move challenge. Yes, that's totally a dumb enough title. Hello, and thanks for messing around. It's more Vampire Survivors. Giovanno is going to be doing some Blood Astronomy -esque stuff today. As well, I use it on Gal, and I feel like using it now. So, let's pull it all off that we can. Also, he has a ton of eggs, because I guess I farmed in Atlantis. I can't remember that far back. I can't remember what I was doing just a few minutes ago. Da -da -da. None of you are blood astronomia. You help. You also help. And there we go. Three, 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 all here. And since it's not on inverse, things will actually die, which is a nice change of pace. Look at that blood astronomia go. They can't even get close. Once they have some durability, that'll change right up. Okay, I've got so many levels, it's scary, so... Let's hurry down to that Arcana chest and grab whatever it is that's there. I don't know what I'm gonna get. Maybe saw an old sanctuary, get the cooldown on Laurel even lower. I get to another character with Heart of Fire, I'm gonna try to, you know not get hit so I can see if it is for sure that uh, only the retaliation damage procs it. Speaking of which, I should do a retaliation here. Yeah, he gets armor when he levels up. Because they die easy because I'm invincible. Because I have so many eggs, it's not a problem. Taking no damage with Diavano, Thelma, and Luis. Uh, cool. Still have no idea why the spread gun videos just completely shoot off compared to everything else I have. It's weird. Could go out of bounds. But I just did that. I also just did Sound Old Sanctuary a ton, but yet I'm still selecting it. Still, it's going to be my only source of damage. Oh, I hit 90? Huh. I wasn't expecting to hit the cap. Oh, right. Well, I should have, considering, you know... Kana. Garlic. Garlic. Alrighty. Everything's going good. Damage is a good thing to have, and just random always because it doesn't matter. And that's huge. Huh, another chest already. That was quick. All right, how much pain can we put on you, Atlantean? Well, since my stuff is completely irrelevant to direction, I'll just run around doing whatever. But I can't go running around. Well, actually, no, I can. I got my laurel. And frankly, enough cooldown and duration that it's probably going to make me invincible. Yeah, I think it already refreshed its cooldown even after that one hit. Giovanno's golden egg surprise. Yeah. Ivano's Golden Eggs bloody style. Yep, look at that Atlantean go down. Yay, more cooldown. Oh, hey, right next to me. Also right next to me is the Atlantean. Hey, a chest that I don't need. Well, thanks for the candy box, I guess. Sure, I could get more stuff, but why? It's 3-3-3. Three, three, three. That's three weapons, three passives, three arcanas with three characters in three stages. Same character three times as three characters. Same stage three times as three stages. Oh, oh.
nice to have something relaxing even after I'm two days four days off of Bill yep that was not a fun time for me I persevered and it accomplished nothing in the end Clearly, I should just make nothing but spread gun videos because they're always hitting a thousand for some reason. I don't know why. It's so strange. Well, probably because I keep calling it spread gun instead of spread shot and people are sp searching for that instead of spread shot. That makes sense. I'm not sure why they're searching for spread shot or gun that often. Yeah, it's the most iconic weapon from Contra, but... Weird. It's weird. In fact, maybe if I just switch her new... Wow, you went down in no time. Oh, Molison. Molison. Random event. Get the trees from Molison. Oh, hey, exploding wave. And you can't do anything, because I have 700... Oh... Well, I have over 700. I thought I had 900. Anyway, I have enough golden eggs and I'm invincible. Yavano is still invincible. Yep, there's the title. In fact, he's probably more invincible than ever. Because what is anything here going to do to this? I should have... No, I don't want to put it on inverse again. Even if he'll be fine, I would need to relax. I am stuffing myself full of work and effort, and I still don't have my bloody schedule up because the thing turned out it was a PDF in multiple parts, so I couldn't just convert it. And that was horrifying to learn. Now I have to go make one entirely from scratch because I can't trust anything else. And that means... Oh. Actually, now that I think about it, I should set up... Why is... Oh, right, that's the chest, not the button. Oh, that's silly. I don't need the chest, so I didn't even bother to grab them. La. Oh, right, there are enemies on screen. Oh, wait, right, that doesn't have a exit on the right side. Well, I went about this in the most obtuse manner possible. <laughs> Man. I swear, there's something about streaming that just causes me to, like, pick up, sneeze, choke all the time. Well, not on camera, on mic. Did I say on mic? Uh, the first thing that goes is the memory. The second thing that goes is the memory as well. Yeah, sure, I could get something else, but why? And I could not. 179 health we're done. Against Wow, you actually have no base health, huh? That's incredible considering one per egg. Well, at least things are going pretty simple for now. How the heck did I get through x dash with just the wings? I must go on Divine Bloodline. Wouldn't make sense otherwise. Yeah, at least Toasty supercharges. x dash has nothing. Oh, right, this is a dead end. Oh, my... Uh, oh, it's Batway from random events, huh? That way from random events, huh? Oh, oh. I don't think any of the DLCs otherwise have the base stuff. And because they're DLCs, I don't think anything they bring up will show up with random events. Unless maybe Academy Badge can. Oh, right, the other Arcana. Unless Academy Badge can spawn in from. Da -da -da. A random passive pickup if you like. Got everything else. To me is possible, not really that feasible. Can I even come over here? I 
Okay, let's get... Uh, I guess out of bounds. It's the only thing that'll really increase my damage at this point. Alrighty. Left and down, and then up and left. Oh, this is the guardian room. And luck, that's just what I needed to turn this around. Oh, this is so relaxing after everything else. Incredible. Ivano is a nice relaxing time while being invincible. But because I didn't use the full title at the start, I'm completely doomed. Wait, no, here's the time. Vampire Survivors, Giovanna is still invincible. Now I just clip it to the start, and bam, the algorithm will love me. Ha 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 ha. Take that. Really, I should just keep adding spread gun to everything. That would somehow work it. And then I will get views, and then I will become popular like I never was in all of my life. Ha 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 ha. Thanks for watching and listening to this incredibly strange ranting. I barely talk about the game half the time just because, well, Yavano is still invincible. Yep. Just, what, did, what do you expect anything to do? Oh, Stalker. Is there a rosary on the map? No. Oh, I can't even see you. You're too cut out by the blood astronomy. I actually have to be careful. Even though I'm pretty sure I have enough duration and cooldown that you aren't going to get through, I don't want to risk it. Now, I could turn the eggs off. I only have a few characters with as many eggs anyway, so it's not a big deal. Besides, sometimes you just want to watch everything die horribly. It's amazing. Almost 100k, not even at 20 minutes. Oh, right, got in. Oh, I can just feel the stress leaving my back. Those pet hearts are doing fine because I got so much dang recovery. Hey, the boss one showed up. Now think of what it would be with that more area. This isn't even remotely as powerful as it could be. You know, I'd have Torona's box, Can Labrador, and Spinach, and, you know, Silver Ring, and heck, even Metaglio left. Dang bottles. Heck, I could even have Boogle of Illusions on. And, you know, I could go grab the Paranormal Scan. Two. We grabbed it from the candy box, and that would have... Eventually, given enough cooldown, compensate for the Silent Little Sanctuary hit. And Might. This is not about Might. Look at their health. This isn't about Might at all. They all die from the Aura Logan. Aura Logan. Savior of many a run. Not this one. 179 health for most chickens. That's more health than he has, really. But, yeah, that's, this is just what a couple hundred eggs. With Brad, it's going to be even more ridiculous once I get back to him. Next century. Yeah, I really wanted to capitalize on Operation Guns and Newness. Get it all up. And it failed. Utterly. Yep. Yvonne was still invincible. 
And now I've used it too much, so now the algorithm is going to check and say, Oh, hoo, hoo, you're spamming hashtag keyword. Now you're not going to get any views. Well, joke's on you. I'm not going to get any views on this anyway. Well, besides the one that comes from when I put up the comment. That doesn't really count. Hey, a vacuum. Hey, a box. Oh, I should move closer to you. And I have garlic, so you should be frozen, spammed. Yep. No damage whatsoever. Maybe I should use Ivano takes no damage instead. You know. The saying invincible is one thing, but no damage is a completely different thing. Now clearly I should just fake it out and do a no move, no active weapon challenge and lie and say it was a challenge when instead I have so many golden eggs. And it's not a challenge because it can't be a challenge because nothing can get in. Next, that is what I should do. Just not, not move or the other ones. It's not like it's going to change anything if I do or not. Well, I guess it would technically take me on a third wave once I don't get the three Arcanas. But whatever. And there's the boss down. It has HP times level and it did nothing. Moving is so tiresome. This is relaxing. I'm not going to move. I'm not going to move at all. Alrighty, almost to the end. Nice to have someone that was so simple. Even Gal had some losses just because I was trying some dopey things. But Diavano, Diavano, you could rely upon to get away with absolute murder. Oh no, I said murder. That means something, something algorithm, blah, blah, blah. Bloody two year olds. Like cigarette companies did care about saying die and kill and murder and manslaughter. Oh right, that's gonna happen. Oh, quitting out. 27.8 on the astronomy on up. Bad though, out of bounds was catching up. Anyway, that's one down, so many more to go. Two, there's two more to go. Okay, it's time for Diavano to go to the Blood Zone. Yeah, we're making the Blood Zone with Blood Astronomy. Yeah. Oh, right. I need damage. You're damage. Wait, you're more damage. Yay. Yeah, so I tried to no move, but you know, Stalker exists and is an enemy. So that was not possible. Well, maybe if I grabbed Empty Toe, but that did not happen. And since I am cutting it way too close as it is, this is only a few hours before posting. And it needs a few hours to develop 4K. And it will need to be uploaded twice because YouTube does not want to process my first video at all for the past week. So that has been agonizing. Speaking of which, I'm probably actually going to change the upload time next week. Because, well, because of it, I posted one at like 5 p.m. and it got more views at the start, so let's see if that helps. Also, it will be posted after the extermination stream, which is helpful. Wait, not five. Yes, five. Yes, five. Five makes sense. Five EST.
They have a vacuum spawned in here. Still don't know why no power-ups spawn in. Chicken's fine. Why why not no vacuums? Why no NFTs? If a vacuum had spawned in, I would have gotten, you know, everything. Probably been able to do it. But I don't want to test that. Though I will still do this on Carlo Kart. Which also has Stalker. But I can get power-ups there. So I could do it. So that's that. And you got 17 minutes times half times 0.5. That's half. Yeah. To go. So that's 8.30 seconds. And since I'm not doing limit break specifications because I don't need it. This will be all good. All fancy paste and pantsed. Come here, Atlantean. I want to drown you like I drowned your city. No. Ew. Who wants a silver ring when there's a gold one down there? I do. I want the silver ring. Give it to me. Ha 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 ha. On a completely random tangent that only makes sense to me. Did you know that Johnny Cage from Mortal Kombat has a brother? On an on random tangent, look at all them enemies get butchered. Oh yeah, look at that kill count go up. Why am I sitting around here when I could go off? Not like you're gonna hurt me. I always go to Silver Frost because it's the most valuable. 45 duration 45 area crazy crazy oh fandom in gold fever 2 i don't know if it ever got posted on a posted video but the reason i actually have gold again is because that bill riser failed so much trying to get his thing done and I had to go farm on Sammy for like five, well, five in-game minutes, but two real-life minutes. And that's what he got me. Millions of gold without any effort. You leave that thing running on endless overnight or something, you're going to end up with so much cash and probably a broken machine. But now, I have a character... Oh, great. A random event stalker showed up. Yay. Yay. Oh, the Atlantean's still alive. Don't worry, stalker, you'll have your brother soon. And then... More of them will show up. Because that is just my luck. It's nothing but stalkers all the way down. All right, I think I saw them. Yep, there's two stalkers. In fact, I'm gonna end up with three of them. So that's not the ten minutes stalker. Unless nine is suddenly ten, which who knows? It's Vampire Survivors. It could very well be that ten is now nine, and nine is now ten, and tomorrow is now Thursday. Wait, no, that's correct. I'm dating the video. Please ignore all the time that I keep dating the video. Should I even be selecting that? I don't know. Dun, 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 dun. To the golden ring. Bye bye, stalker. You can't catch me. Ah, yes. Vampire Stalkers. Bone Zone, no damage. Oh yeah. Bone Zone. 
bone zone. I still think three ladies walk into the bone zone is one of my best titles. Really can't match. All oh, right, Kana chest. Hey, look at all that healing. It's somehow more than it was before. Alrighty. There's a chest here. There is a sign old sanctuary there. And a bunch of levels right up par. I was not going towards the gold ring at all, was I? Crazy. Man, even... Oh, he does move slower by default, so all the eggs only pushed him up to, like, normal movement speed effectively. Or what one considers normal movement speed after everything else. Nope, went past it. So easy to blow past these ones here on, on Moon Glow. Not Moon Spell, though, Moon Glow. Bye bye. Oh, one Atlantean down. One more golden egg for its horde. Yeah, this wasn't even intentional when you know that's 50k. Or, er, well, 48,000. Maybe I can see what Skeletomari is doing. Being a big ball of bones? That seems likely. Fifteen minutes, now we're in danger. You know, Disco Gold is just a good pickup here since everything's gonna be money. You're always gonna have an endless source of healing when you get Sarah Bonday on the back end. Hello, Skeletomari. How's it going? Slow? Small? Huh? You mean the boss? Oh, you're the Atlantean. Wait, its mask went flying. Did that always happen? Huh. No, you can't do anything, can you? And if I attack you from above, you don't get knocked back like you used to. Aha! High level strategies. Fighting a boss, most people will just ignore after the first time they take it down and get whatever it is you drop a golden bugle. That feels right, even though it's probably wrong. Hey, healing, nice. Does this come on? Yeah, this goes on to 25. Why was I thinking 20? Because 20 would make more sense. I didn't really need to get... I have so much stuff on the backlog to do. I'm so bad at time management. Nope. Oh, you died. Truly a greater fate has not befallen skeleton kind before. Rest in pieces, sweet prince. Rest in pieces. When are we getting Skeletomari playable character? Huh? Get on it, Ponkel. Get on it. Maybe I should include Ponkel in the tags. I mean, that would be weird, right? I'm a yawning. That's what no sleep gets ya. Yawning. Yeah, I'm not seeing the really scary skeletons. The ones that some might call spooky scary. Oh, right, you're existing. Let's fix that right quick. I'll send you home, Mr. Atlantean. I'll send you home. The great... Well, not briny deep. Well, kind of briny deep. I mean, not fully briny. That's really more of a surfacey thing. We just sort of say briny deep because it's... A phrase, and we don't question the truth of phrases. The most important video of our time is Spiffing Brett's Game Studio video.
because it is quite literally learning that fake until you make it works. Oh, hey, an arcana chest. I should grab that. And get nothing. Actually, let's get out of bounds again and see if it can beat up Blood Astronomia again. That would be a funny comparison. You're all the way at the end and you're still going to win. You're going to have like two minutes. Two minutes of fun. Man, I'm always going to be paranoid about the dang audio again. You know, I, I actually haven't watched any of the recent videos on the TV because I just, you know, I had the audio settings correct. But maybe I've angled the mic wrong again. Maybe I should make sure it's this level of eye level. Blah. But it's a top down mic, so I can't have it, you know, closer to the old mouth, because otherwise. Well, for one thing, the arm isn't long enough with where I'm sitting. But I'm playing this on the TV, and the TV is not flush with the computer monitor, which causes some issues. And when I start playing Elden Ring, Shadows of the Earth Tree on Friday, not Thursday. Friday. Boy, is it going to be annoying keeping up with... Well, there's not going to be any chatters, but still. You know, which I really need to get that set up too. Boy, is being both a video creator and a streamer a trying thing when I have to also work every single day. Boy, it would be nice if someone wasn't screwing me over. Hear that, me? Stop screwing me over. Oh yeah, I'll screw over who I want to screw over. Oh yeah. Wait, why isn't it over? Is this 30 minutes? Why is this 30 minutes? I refuse to believe this is sensibly 30 minutes. That doesn't make sense. First, you bone zone. No one can bone for 30 minutes. That's just illogical. But there it is. 30 minutes, well, 15, well, probably about 16 minutes of bone zone, ultimately. Good grief, it's just exhausting playing bone zone that long, eh? Even if I'm not doing that much. Lock that. Okay. And Carlo Kart's gonna go super fast at least. So, actually, we'll be able to get this video up in a sensible time frame. That's a welcome relief. And then I'll actually have enough time on the back end to hopefully start preluding stuff. I really do not want to... I really need to make sure that I have the Beswick for Friday taken care of ahead of time. Because I do not want to spend any time except Erd Tree in time. It's kind of funny having a boss named Mesmer and, well... Channel name is Mezzine around and Mezzine comes, well, Mezzi comes from mesmerizing, which is a funny, funny situation to go through. Huh. This is wild. And also, I haven't played Elden Ring heavily since like the release year. So this is basically just going to be like skillless degenerate playthrough. Like Vampire Survivors and Starship Troopers Extermination and everything else I've done. Who needs skill when you have nasty? Hey Reaper. Oh, I should level up. 170. Wow, I was only 44 levels, huh? Alright, uh, and the priest has taken over the bone zone.
Wouldn't you know it. Alrighty, and on to the finale of Diavano's quest for being invincible. We're going to be not moving, quote unquote, on Carlo Kart. Oh, I have blood of stone on me, so empty tome it right now. Da, da, da. Oh, I forgot it goes to the right. I've been on inverse so long. Hey, garlic. Hey, greatest jubilee. That'll get me vacuums, which will get me things to pick up. Yeah. Because I have a track door, all the gems will be coming to me. This is actually incidentally irrelevant because they'll just loop around eventually and frankly with a track orb I can't miss anything anyway probably actually have more boost pads than not moving huh that's a two that's a three wait no it isn't and now I just mash a Yep. Easiest no move moving challenge of all. And without those tri blunders showing up. Well, actually, no, the stalkers exist. Huh, rosary. Well. But can you get through it? Or I could get lucky with a rosary popping into it. <laughs> Okay. I wasn't expecting that as a solution, but there it is. Mm. Giovanno. Moving no move challenge. Yes, that's totally a dumb enough title. Now, at the very least, when, you know, the Reaper variants show up. They do basically no damage here for some reason. What the heck? I... And I get chests. This is more chests than I would have gotten normally. Jeez. Well, that was weird. It felt like I was actually moving again. Wow, double rosary. I mean, greatest jubilee. Oh, I actually completed a lap. Wasn't expecting that. Heck, I think it's faster than I would have normally done it. You know, my actual kill count's pretty lousy considering the time, but... Weird. There's not that much XP being left behind, too. 182 chickens, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, should I go? Tifano's invincible, still invincible. Tifano takes no damage, or Tifano's moving no move challenge. I think moving no move challenge is the dopiest one. It's not like I'm gonna be able to use it again while well, I can still use no damage or still invincible elsewhere. So, yeah. We're going with Divano's moving no move challenge. Or I guess non challenge works as well. Yeah, Vampire Survivors challenge non moving no Vampire Survivors no move challenge while well moving. That makes no sense. It's definitely going to be the thumbnail picture. Definitely going to be the thumbnail picture. I should probably not be. God.
Oh, hey, there's Stalker. Wow, you just sort of fall back normally, huh? And another rosary out of nowhere saves me. Well, not out of nowhere, but still. Bye-bye, Reaper. You still get... or bye-bye, Stalker. You get frozen even when you're on your defeat animation, huh? Poor Logan pops. Interesting. So you aren't actually destroyed. You're still an active model. You just get pushed off. I'm like, well, no, the other Reapers can die in other stages, but they just get pushed away here. Here's the Maddener, who will accomplish very little because you're not actually fast enough to catch me. Oh, there you are. No, oh, I took damage. But you do very little, and I have enough recovery. That kind of doesn't matter. Da -da -da. Yay! I get curse and speed and attraction. I wonder how many times you can lap this with a red death. I'm going to try to tr check that. Hey, it's the Darkener. Oh, two of you are up at once. So you're not timed, you're actually hit base. Still way not Ender 2.0. This time the black one is in a cloak or something instead of being a new. Wait, did I stop? Why is it? Oh, right. It's when they freeze like that with their destruction animation. It looks like I'm not moving. Well, I'm. I'm actually not moving. Yeah, since I'm moving, not moving. Well, this is a confusing situation, eh? Vacuum. And more lock. Yay, lock. I'm almost there. Wait, is it 15 or 20? I mean, I don't think I've seen... Well, no, Drowner isn't going to show up. That's why Shadow Darkener is here. Because Drowner would not work with this setup at all. Ooh. Okay, they haven't shown up, so it's a 20-minute stage. Oh, there they are. What is 15 minutes? Oh, there's Drowner. He's just not using your ability. So I destroy you without even noticing? Is that another Rosary? That just coincidentally timed with an oral again. Oh, that pushes me ahead. Alright, yep, 15 minutes, and that's the entire bloodline taken care of. Greatest Jubilee did Greatest Jubilee things, yay. And with the power of golden eggs, Diavano has taken us down with... Three more victories. 313. Over here. 314 on the bone zone. And 315 on Carlo Kart. No move. Moving. Challenge complete. Next up is going to be Zia Asunta, who will be much less simple. Look forward to it. Thank you for watching. I hope you had some fun, perhaps enough to like, dislike, comment, or subscribe. Either way, I hope you have a good day and you keep messing around in Vampire Survivor's Beswick.